So the first thing is you want to get your tongue out for the TH. So sometimes the TH can sound rather like a D. So for instance, mudder, mudder. And this is because the tongue is just tapping on the roof of the mouth rather than coming out and under the teeth. Mother, mother, like that, mother. Tiny tip, pulse the sound from your belly. Mother, mother. You'll feel your belly go in a little bit. Mother, mother. And this way, your voice is supported from your belly. This is where your power is. And you get more bang for your buck if you engage your belly as you speak. So, mother, mother. And you won't be pushing from your throat, which is great for the voice. And the second tip is to carry your voice right to the end to get those consonants. So, for instance, sometimes dog, g, dog, dog could sound like dog. And leaves, you want to get that V, leaves, can sound like leaf, leaf, leaf. So make sure to keep the voice going right till the end. And final thing is the R. So in British English, we do not pronounce the R at the end of a word or in the middle of a word. When it's after a long vowel and when it's before a consonant. So I'll give you an example. For instance, for runner, runner, runner. Instead of saying runner, 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 you want to go runner, 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 like a lazy sound at the end. It's like a throwaway sound. Runner, runner. And then for farm, farm, you want to go farm, 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 farm. So go long R and then just up for the M, farm. Earth, earth, instead of earth, you might want to say a T for the TH. Earth, earth. There you go, three top tips. Happy practicing.